Welcome again to Mr. Han's tutorial about setting up your workspace in Google SketchUp. On the previous tutorial we downloaded the template and we set up a template file for uh, the CO2 dragster here. So you can see we got the car, we got a half car, we got a little uh, model that's doubled up here. We got our all of our scenes here so that we can work through our scenes. Now it's time to set up our toolbars. The first thing I want to do is go view tool palettes large tool sets and that's going to give me a toolbar over on the left hand side. This top toolbar has got some tools on it that are fairly useless right now. Um, they're, they're good for other things but just not usable in this application. So what we're going to do is we're going to customize that as well. So we're going to right click on here and hit customize toolbar. So again, that was right-clicking and customize toolbar. Now we can start moving around icons up here. I can get rid of this square icon. I can get rid of the offset icon. Orbit's okay. I can get rid of this zoom icon. Pan is okay. And I can get rid of some of these other icons here. And now I can start dragging up icons that I want to use. First of all is standard views. I use standard views a lot. The undo and redo button is a nice icon as well. And then looking down, zoom extents is a great icon to have up. So right now, I just have some basic icons there up across the top. Oh, I see I missed one. One more to add is the eraser. I always put that over here next to the pencil. And then dimension tool up there. And once I have all those set up, I hit done. Now you'll see that the icons at the top, there are some repetitive ones that are over here, but the key to this now is if I right click on it and hit icon and text, it gives me information underneath. So it tells me what those tools are. And I always use small size. So it still tells me what they are. There's standard views is over here. I click on that, I can go to the standard views and different standard views. And this is what I like our sheet to be set up as. On our next tutorial, we'll start designing our car.